In the crisp winter air, at the end of the year, Oridon celebrates holiday cheer. And by the light of the tree, they spread decoration. Followed, of course, <laughs> by play and celebration. What a sight, exclaimed Jay, with his eyes full of glee. On the aisle, we never had a holiday tree. How lame, scoffed Chad, dragging his sleigh. Where'd Santa leave your stuff on Christmas Day? Not all are so lucky, said Lonnie to Chad. Some kids don't get presents, and not because they're bad. But holidays are more than just getting new things. Take this star, for example, and the feeling it brings. Fairy Godmother spelled it with holiday spirit. As soon as it's placed, we're sure to all feel it. The kids stood there stunned, mesmerized by the glow. This was pure Christmas magic they'd never before known. Aw, oh, man, that was my job, complained Chad with a leer. I always put the star on the tree every year. But whatever, he added. Come on, Ben, let's jet. The clock's ticking, and I still have presents to get. Not this year, Ben smiled. I'm excited to show these guys all the holiday things they've yet to know. The holiday magic was something of dreams. Their hearts warmed their souls. They could burst at the seams. But not everyone was happy, nor fast asleep dreaming. Somewhere in the shadows, someone was out scheming. Oridon awoke, dismayed at the sight, where once stood the pillar of holiday light. Who would do this? Mal cried. Lonnie just shook her head. Someone hateful, I fear, one whose heart's full of dread. For when the star's taken into and by the wrong hands, there's no telling what next. Through the thief, the star plans. The next few days, more and more presents were gone, as went the reindeer from the sleigh and the lawn. The people kept fighting. Worst Christmas so far. All were blamed for the thieving. All because of the star. Perhaps Jay can find him, Chad said with a smirk. Jay does have a history of fine thievery work. It does take an old thief to know how they think, Jay said slyly to the Oridon folks with a wink. Just leave it to me, because I'm not afraid. I can catch this thief blindfolded. Game, set, match, played. Ha ha, Chad exclaimed. It was Jay all the while. That's proof that these kids should return to the aisle. Come on, Ben, let's go. We've better things to do. Chad said, looking down upon Mal and her crew. I can't, replied Ben. I should be there for Mal. No way Jay did this, and we'll prove it somehow. Mal said, Jay, no doubt your detention will be brief. We love you, we'll help you. We know you're no thief. Come on, guys, Chad said, looking at everyone. Show's over, now can we get back to the fun? But no one would join them. They were all too sad. They felt Christmas was ruined. Secretly, so did Chad. Hey, Chad, Carlos said. We made something for you. We could all use some cheer, so we hope this will do. Inside, a new ornament to display. Signed, your friends, Mal, Evie, Dude, Carlos, and Jay. The cloaked figure returned under the cover of dark, but Oridon was alerted by Dude's mighty bark. You've been busted red-handed, yelled Evie with fury. You've no idea how you've made everyone worry. But to their surprise, when the thief turned around, it was Chad with the star and his eyes to the ground. It was you? Questioned Carlos. You sure let us down. This isn't what I wanted, Chad said with a frown. I was jealous of you guys and the joy you were sharing. What I meant as a prank became quite overbearing. The spell from the star, it took control over me. It turned me against the holiday glee. It made me want more, so I stole to no end. But then you treated me kindly, like I was your friend. We get it, said Ben, but you caused quite a fuss. Now restoring the holiday spirit is on us. And besides, said Jay, you've got it all wrong. Of course you're our friend. We've been friends all along. The tree was relit and the magic replenished. The holiday spirit restored to the finish. Is it true? Chad asked Jay. The aisle doesn't have Christmas? Well, let's bring it to them. They shouldn't have to miss this. As Mal, Evie, Carlos, Ben, Lonnie, and Jay led a Santa dressed Chad in a present filled sleigh <laughs> through a clear winter sky with the stars beaming light, the aisle would experience Christmas tonight. And so Christmas was saved. Oridon was at rest. And of all the years to come, they liked this one the best.